for this uh, session on Gita for Youth. Hare Krishna. So there are many discussions takes place in a society in between friends, in between boyfriend, girlfriends, in between classmates, roommates, in between two faculties, in between teacher and student, in between two political parties. Everywhere there are a talk, there is a discussion going on. Now, every discussion starts with the question. If you carefully observe, every discussion, every talk starts with the question. It is said early morning, you may have heard birds chirping. Sounds, you know, comes every early morning. There are some birds, they come on the top of the branches of the trees and they make sounds, chirping sounds. Even that talk is also starts with the question, where is my food today? Where are you going today? Which side you are going today? So birds start speaking. Any discussion starts with the question answers, questions. Now for today, it's a discussion on the question, why start bhakti or Krishna consciousness in an early age, in an young age? What is the need of becoming a gentleman, you know, monk, sadhu, sannyasi, whatever, sannyasi, you know, sannyasi. Why early age? Why to become, why to take up Bhagavad Gita into the hands in early age? Why? So, I would like to ask this question as an open up discussion. I will take up some points, some views from your side, and then we will go for the discussion. Hare Krishna. Yes. What do you think? Is it necessary really to read Bhagavad Gita, understand Bhagavad Gita, get into spirituality in an early age? Why do you think so? Yes. Anybody please respond quickly. You can unmute yourself and say it. It will be more interactive. So let me ask the question again. Why do you think a student age or young age he has to get into spirituality, bhakti yoga, or Krishna consciousness. Take up Bhagavad Gita and read Bhagavad Gita. Why? Why do you think so? Why not a little late? Once you get settled, or once you get married, or once you get money in the hands, once you get children, their education. Why so early? Yes. Yes, devotees, please respond. Yes, please. Prabhuji, in the young age, the, the mind is very flexible. So if, if it engages in a good manner or in a good direction, right direction, uh, it will be, it will follow up to up till his uh, adulthood and the uh, old age also. So okay. that's why it's... So that's why it's required. Rahul? Yes, sir. It's very important. Thank you, Rahul. Thank you, Rahul Sharma. Uh, Rahul Sharma opened up with a very wonderful point. In an engage only, we are we get tuned very easily to the frequency. You know, it's very easy to tune our mindset in an engage. It's very active and it's very practical. If you don't tune in a right way at this stage, then we are going to face hard days ahead. Thank you, Rahul Sharma. Yes, uh, Shriya, I think Shriya or Shantanu, someone opened up. Hare Krishna, Prabhuji. Yes, Shriya. Hare Krishna. Prabhuji, once we start getting old, uh, our energy, our, uh, our remembrance, this all comes down. So, uh, and, and, we, and we don't, we are not much flexible when we get old to uh, to understand 
the scriptures bhagavad gita and devotional service and when we are young we easily get to know about them and when we get old our, uh, we don't have the physical strength to do service yeah that's good so we won't get that much flexible you know now only we are flexible let us you know mold into the desired way afterwards it will become hard nut you know hard nut literally it becomes hard just like you see your parents or grandparents you tell them anything it is they, they cannot digest it they cannot digest it that much easily so this is a flexible days flexible young age even to shape our body also you know even to shape our six packs or my, whatever the packs you know we uh, try to young boys try to get it or uh, whatever the size zero size you know people look forward for this young age is the one which can tune uh, not just body but mind and spirit soul too it's a very flexible age afterwards it becomes very hard i know uh, one mata ji who generally comes to temple and she was worshiping ganesh ji sai baba from her childhood onwards she is very very interested in worshiping ganesh ji because they are mumbai kids and sai baba because shirdi is very near it is quite popular in maharashtra nasik this shirdi so they are uh, strong worshipers or followers of sai baba but when she came to krishna consciousness iskon society she heard for the first time sai baba is not god ganesh ji is not a supreme god so when she heard this for the first time krishna is the supreme personality of godhead are krishna is only god all others are not gods oh all are demigods she got shocked and uh, you know it took uh, at, at least one year for her to get into tune in you know, one year she took to get into tuned with krishna consciousness philosophy so from childhood whatever we take up and that that is the foundation for our future thank you shriya for nice point so this is the flexible age let's flexibly mold ourselves in a right path yeah so some more yes shantanu maybe i request her, please speak out that will be more nice i request instead of chat uh, maybe speak out yes shantanu i think i saw you unmuted yourself please you can present your point why do you think spirituality is required in engage is shantanu is there oh he's not there anyone hare krishna prabhu ji hare krishna prabhu ji engage engage is learning it right like, and we we know what to do and what not to do we learn to implement further uh, in our life like in adulthood middle age or old age we implement what we learn in uh, in our engage engage is learning age and uh, what we learn we inculcate in our uh, in our life and we become a particular uh, mindset in engage itself yes that's, That's why in gita says, gita says yeah, yes, gita says gita says what to do how it is about ourselves who are we what we have to do what is our responsibility duties who is god it says about ourselves so if we learn in engage or if we get into devotional path in engage we'll get to know what is right what is wrong we'll be conscious about uh, doing things so in adulthood Uh, it will help in our adulthood or middle age in old age yes thank you very much pranavi for that so you see children's children's in their very uh, chenu age in a beginning age of themselves they think their parents are their heroes my father is superman my mother is superwoman for me and every child thinks so but to as as they grow in age as they progress in age they think ah uh, let me test my parents how much they know i have many questions i will ask them and torture them so children they start asking questions to parents 
mama mama do you know this papa papa do you know this tell me answer this for this you know you know they challenge parents do they really know or not as they grow in age more they come to teenage whatever so they see literally speaking they understand they think that parents doesn't know anything there are more bigger people than our parents they know much more than our parents so that's why parents they introduce teachers in the students life in the child children's life so next uh, after the parents uh, every child thinks that um, i want to become uh, like my father in the beginning i will become a teacher like my teacher next so that's how they get molded slowly and gradually so this is age to know what is good what is not good what is better for me what is not better for me what i should eat what i should not eat what kind of clothes i should wear what should, what kind of clothes i should not wear you know it's it's a personal choice but that personal choice depends on the the character personality so that is only get molded in this age in the youth afterwards it becomes very difficult every teacher is facing this problem every parent is press facing this problem nowadays it is you know it's to be frank even in childhood it is becoming a too difficult parents are not able to control their children teachers are not able to control their students in the classrooms as soon as teacher turns towards the board black board or white board now it is digital boards immediately students started starting they start criticizing teacher so many things cracking a jokes on teachers so it is it became a common trend nowadays it became a common trend it is it is becoming very very difficult to manage you know to take care of the children even even for uh, parents especially in covid 19 in the quarantine in lockdown time every parents they understood very easily it is very very hard to manage with the children that's why you know it is very very hard how to deal with the children so thank you very much pranavi for the response yes so okay this is how very important in this engage this is engage very practical mind active mind we can tune we can flexibly mode our results and this is the age to learn yes this is the age to learn but unfortunately if i ask any student college student who is going to college why you are going to college what they respond i asked some, many students i asked many students in my uh, experience in my interactions with the students why do you go to college everybody mostly they say anybody would like to guess what they say generally why you are going to college what they say anybody anybody here going to college or schools shriya anybody why you are going to college school yes to earn money most of the people they say this simply i want to earn money i want to get a job this is the core purpose why people are going to schools and colleges that is a quite unfortunate thing actually this is the age to learn not to earn if you learn in this age later you can easily earn if you start earning now only not learning not not focusing on learning then it is it becomes very hard time in the future so this is the age to learn what is good what is not good what is the wisdom who are we who am i why i am suffering why i have come to like this you know why so all the questions they get answered in this spirituality so many questions they don't have answers in a materialistic education studies they don't have answers for many questions they have only one answer that is money that's why earn get job get marks get job earn money that that is only one answer they know when they feel hungry they feed you coins they feed you uh, notes they cannot feed you grains because there is no education study where they teach you how to uh, do all that 
so they completely depends on the money based so my next question thank you for the responses all of you has given very nicely so many times parents say are uh, okay speak in hindi okay mera agla prashna hai so hear carefully bahut baar jab bach you know students jab bhakti karne bhakti karna shuru karte hai हरे कृष्णा महामंत्र जप करना या मंदिर जाना टीका लगाना सर पे या ट्रेडिशनल ड्रेस पहनना ऐसा शुरू करते माता पिता को बहुत गुस्सा आता नॉट ऑल सब माता पिता नहीं लेकिन जो पढ़े लिखे माता पिता या आसपास जो जॉबर्स है उन लोगों को अभी क्या करने का अभी क्या उम्र है क्या ये सब बुढ़ापे में करने का सब नो no. now the question is what is the right age okay you are saying this is the age at this time we should practice bhakti so how do you respond to your parents kaise aap mata pita ko batayenge ki kaise ye yahi umar hai padhne ke liye yahi umar hai bhagavad gita bhi padhne ke liye yahi umar hai jaisa maths physics chemistry padhne ka yahi umar hai aise hi bhagavad gita bhi padhne ka yahi umar hai kaise aap mata pita ko samjhayenge ये बताइए कोई माता पिता को जब डाउट लगने लगता है मेरा बच्चे मेरा बच्चा साधु बन जाएगा मेरा बच्चा सन्यासी बन जाएगा सन्यास यू नो इन साउथ इंडिया स्टिल नाउ मेनी पीपल साउथ इंडिया इन साउथ इंडिया मेनी पीपल दे स्कोल्ड गाली देते हैं बच्चों को सन्यासी कुछ काम का नहीं बट सन्यासी सन्यासी द मीनिंग ऑफ सन्यासी इज सत प्लस न्यासी one who walks on the right path is sanyasi is a gentleman sadhu gentleman that is the meaning of sadhu sadhu doesn't mean one who wears this you know red cloth he only saffron he only sadhu no one who is a gentleman having a good behavior he is also known as sadhu gentleman sat sanyasi sanyasi doesn't mean that one who renounces everything give up everything and goes so how do you respond to your parents when your parents says ah abhi nahi baad mein karo so how do tackle that yes kaise aap mata pita ko samjhayenge samjhana bhul jayenge how you face your parents yes how can you convince your parents for uh, uh, reading bhagavad gita going to temple having a traditional dress tilak chanting hare krishna how do you convince avoiding meat eating avoiding meat eating parents becomes very shocked when you stop eating meat they say ha ha ram krishna bhi bhagwan bhagwan bhi mams ka they say so many things so any any responses any responses anybody would like to give there is a bhakti and study can be done both uh, parallelly uh, as we yes. study in school like that we is like that uh, parallelly we can uh, read uh, scripture bhagavad gita also and and what we uh, follow that's right only right we are not le- learning anything bad we are uh, instead we are uh, taking the right path and uh, the right knowledge yes thank you so bahut long ko ek samasya rehta hai ek prashna rehta hai ki bhakti karte karne ke samay padhai pe dhyan chala jayega to iske liye main bhakti nahi karunga mata pita ka bhi yahi dar hai jab aap bhakti karne lagte ho bhakti mein bahut gehra chala jate hai ki padhai pe dhyan ज्यादा नहीं रहता है सो दट इज अ फियर माता पिता हैज सो दट्स वाई वी शुड कन्विंस अवर पेरेंट्स माता पिता को कन्विंस करना चाहिए कि कैसे हम भक्ति के साथ भक्ति के साथ पढ़ाई के पे भी ध्यान रख के आगे बढ़े अच्छे से पढ़ाई करते करते भक्ति पे भी ध्यान दो चीज कर सकते हैं जैसा पढ़ाई पे में पढ़ाई में भी पांच छह सब्जेक्ट भी रहता है मैथ्स फिजिक्स केमिस्ट्री बायोलॉजी वो ये बहुत सारे सब्जेक्ट रहता है कैसे आप इतना सब्जेक्ट को संभाल के आगे जा रहे हो 
ऐसी भक्ति में भी आगे बढ़ सकते हो भक्ति पालन करते करते पढ़ाई पे भी ध्यान करके आगे जा सकते ये एक कन्विंस ये चीज आपका माता पिता को ट्रस्ट देना चाहिए आपको विश्वास देना चाहिए नहीं तो माता पिता डर जाएंगे अरे भक्ति पढ़ाई पे ध्यान नहीं दे रहा है भक्ति भक्ति बोल रहा है वो मंदिर बोल रहा है हरे कृष्ण जब कर रहा है तो माता पिता को डर लगे तो इसके लिए हम दोनों को साथ में रख के आगे बढ़ना चाहिए और बहुत लोग पूछते हैं कि क्या उम्र है पढ़ने का समझने का भगवद गीता समझने का पालन करने का अंडरस्टैंड दिस वेरी केयरफुली If you, if I ask you, क्या उम्र है आपका आई एम ट्वेंटी नाइन ईयर्स ओल्ड सो ट्वेंटी नाइन ईयर्स ओल्ड सो वी आर गेटिंग ओल्ड एंड ओल्डर पालन बिल्कुल नहीं कर सकते तो जब हिंग है जब वी आर स्ट्रांग एंड स्टाउट हमको भगवद गीता पढ़ना चाहिए समझना चाहिए पालन भी करना चाहिए नहीं तो बूढ़ा पे में क्या पढ़ सकते हो चार आंग के साथ क्या पढ़ सकते हैं हम you know, what we can practice? It is very difficult. What we can preach? So preaching तो भूल जाओ प्रचार करने तो भूल जाओ पालन करना भी बहुत मुश्किल है समझना और मुश्किल है क्योंकि बूढ़ापा में दिमाग इतना चाल चाल नहीं है so this is engage very very engage now when you propose a girl for example when you have a girlfriend you maybe boyfriend maybe. okay it's okay so when you go to your you know loved ones you take a rose flower right so do you take pale bent down old rose flower or fresh rose flower generally we take fresh rose flower very beautifully looking fresh rose flower so when we want to offer ourselves to krishna bhagwan so humko budhapa mein karna chahiye eng in this engage we should offer ourselves to krishna our services to krishna our mind our strength our speaking skills all that to krishna in engage so this is the right age to perform bhakti if somebody says next time ah budhapa mein karna chahiye abhi kya jaldi hai yes it's jaldi because it is very very much very much required another point please note it down very much, very very important to start bhakti in early age prahlada narsing chaturdashi is coming prahlada says kaumaram acharet pragna from the 5 years old everybody should start uh, chanting hari krishna reading bhagavatam kaumaram acharet pragne धर्मान भागवता निह दुर्लभम मनुषम जन्म तदपी अध्रुव अर्थदम सो एवरीबडी अट फाइव इयर्स ओल्ड दे हेव टू स्टार्ट भगवद भक्ति वाय बिकॉज वाय बिकॉज डेथ इज अन्शूर डेथ मे कम अट एनी टाइम डेथ मे नॉक नॉक यू डाउन अट एनी टाइम पता नहीं मृत्यु कभी भी आ सकता तो इसके लिए ये मानव जन्म मिला है बहुत सुदुर्लभ है बहुत सुदुर्लभ इसके लिए भक्ति जितना जल्दी हो सकते हैं उतना जल्दी चालू करना चाहिए एंड वंस वंस वन इंटरव्यूअर आस्क्ड प्रभुपाद व्हाई यू हैव सो मेनी एंगस्टर्स इन योर इस्कॉन टेंपल्स सो मेनी एंगस्टर्स व्हाई देन प्रभुपाद रिस्पोंडेड व्हाई देयर आर सो मेनी एंगस्टर्स गोइंग टू कॉलेज एंड स्कूल्स एट दिस एज आई एम रिपीटिंग इट वंस अगेन interviewer asked prabhupad why in iskon you have so many youngsters both you are log hai iskon mein kyo then prabhupad replied in asking question back why youngsters are going to schools and colleges then interviewer said oh this is age to learn they are going to learn so yes this is also learning so prabhupad says iskon is not just a place of worship iskon is actually educational institute iskon is educational institute so how many minutes we have avish prabhu less than 1 minute prabhu sir oh less than 1 minute okay so i think uh, there are some chat chat thoughts maybe i i could not read that so maybe uh, please note it down you can repeat it again 
thank you very much so should we start again for today we can end here another time we'll have another meeting thank you very much so at this age chanting hari krishna reading bhagavad gita understanding is very very important so engage me bhakti paana chahiye practice karna chahiye hari krishna bahut bahut dhanyawad jagat guru shri